बिस्मिल्लाम वेलकम टू माई चैनल लर्न मैथ विथ सैयद अली टूडे अवर टॉपिक इज सिम्यूलेशन सिम्यूलेशन इन लैंग्वेज और इन इंग्लिश लैंग्वेज सिम्यूलेशन मीन्स इन इमिटेशन और एन एक्टमेंट एन एक्टमेंट ऑफ समथिंग as of something anticipated right so it's not the actual but it's a is a way like it's a simulation is a way of collecting data using actual object such as coin spinners or cards so that means model or representative example of something when we create a computer program let's say so and that computer program will do or will model the flying of a plane so it's a simulation right so is a um, uh, for for grade 8 students is a big uh, word but for uh, for the computer science student or engineering student it will have more details in upcoming videos right so simulation is the way of collecting data using actual objects such as coin spinners cards what does it mean it means that we have for example we have three type uh, in last video we did a customer coming in and he she has a choice of three type of the shirt right three type of the shirt three type in last video we did a customer has got a choice of three type of a shirt and two type of pants right and we see that how the outcomes were right there were total six outcomes can we simulate it with something is something using coin spin spinner head or cards or something like object we can simulate this situation because we know this situation from our Uh, last video so how we can simulate this situation to the other to represent this right so like something anticipated like this like we have to pretend that or we have to assume that this is equals to this or this can be simulated as this so if i say okay this is the situation which we read in the last video or deal with the last video three types of the shirt and two types of the pant a customer has got choice of uh, total number of outcomes were six right now we can say we can write down few statement and we have to choose the correct one so first statement is a number sim simulation statement a number cube labeled from 1 to 6 and a coin is this thing relating to this situation a number cube cube has got six sides no it's not related to this because here we have three types of the shirt and two types of the pant right how to simulate how to conduct simulation we have to see the describe possible outcomes we have to describe the possible outcome and possible outcome we see from the previous video that she has got the customer has got three types of uh, of shirt collection right one was plain other was frill and other was uh something like that right so uh that was frill and third one was anything you can say that flowers or mm, painted or lace right other was lace right so plain flower and lace and then with each condition she has got two choices so total number of the outcomes was black pant or gray pant black pant or gray pant black pant or gray pant so we have six outcomes right so in simulation also we have to say that how many outcomes are there here is a cube and a coin so coin has got two sides right we choose the number and cube has got six sides that means the total number of outcomes will be 12 so this cannot be the simulation for this situation now we go to the second statement i spinner 
divided into three equal parts into three equal parts and a coin and a coin so this situation and a coin right coin has got two faces head and tail and a spinner is divided into three equal parts so that means this situation has got the total number of the outcome as this outcome as this example as this situation as this happening so we are, we can enact or we can pretend that okay this situation is our simulation statement is this another statement question say i spinner a spinner divided into five equal parts divided into five equal parts and a coin so here total number of the outcome for coin is two and to here a spinner is divided into five equal parts that means total outcome will be 10 so this situation is also not relating to my situation my situation is three types of the shirt and two types of the pant right so total outcome we did in the last video six outcomes right so simulation is a way of collecting data using actual object such as coin spinners or card right so this is this is what which simulation model so we we did here which simulation model is relating to this situation right so what are the steps describe the possible outcome so first step is to determine is how to simulate how to simulate uh, some pronunciation is simulate or simulate is the same thing so simulation or right how to conduct simulation or simulation right simulation how to conduct simulation i i pronounce it as simulation so simul how to conduct simulation how to conduct i didn't write conduct how to conduct simulation so first step what we did here when we decide that this is the right simulation for this um, for this outcome right for three types of the shirt and two types of the pen what we did we did first of all describe the outcome describe the possible outcome so in first situation the outcome was not telling my outcome so six times two is 12 which is not right in second situation i have a spinner into three parts three equal parts and a coin so this was right simulation for my situation i choose that right i i make a tick mark now i am describing the steps how i did achieve that so the first step is describe the possible outcome second is link each outcome link each outcome what does it mean we can link link each outcome right six faces of the cube right with the two right so we can say one cube cube can give you one one with head and one with tail then two two with head and two with tail three so this example will end up with six times two is like 12 outcome here we can have three div spinner divided into three equal parts maybe they have colors red yellow blue and then a coin so red will go with the head then red will go with the tail then red will go with the so if it is red blue and green red blue and green right then blue will go with the head blue will go with the tail green will go with the head green will so there are six outcome so link each outcome Hope you understand i mean we have to link each outcome means what is happening with this and this you understand so if we have three spinner has got three equal parts right red blue and green so we have to link each with the coin coin has got two head and tail so red goes with head red goes with tail 
ब्लू गोज हेड ब्लू गोज विथ थे ग्रीन विथ गोज हेड ग्रीन विथ गो विथ थे सिक्स आउटकम्स राइट सो दिस इज सिमुलेशन फॉर दिस सिचुएशन सो वाई वी हैव टू लिंक ईच आउटकम सो वी चूज अ सोर्स चूज a source choose a source means we have to see that what outcomes are here we can choose a coin a spinner or a card right so we can choose any of those so choose a source so we know our outcomes six outcomes and then we choose a source to represent that situation so here we choose six a spinner divided into three equal parts and a coin we choose this situation for this condition because we know our outcomes right choose a source then choose a random number and then based on that random number choose a random number and then we have to repeat right then we have to based on the random number we have to simulate the outcomes right so for each outcome here we can simulate right so for plain shirt black pant plain shirt gray pant and here we have red and head red and tail right so we can simulate each situation choose a random number based on the random number we can simulate the outcome so last step is simulate the outcome so hope you understand it i will repeat it or revise it one more time so that you know we have to repeat then then this is step 4 and 5 to see that uh, each and every outcome of the real situation is simulated by the uh, by the objective uh, actual object right with the actual object right so we we choose here coin spinner or cards right so what was the situation a customer coming in from the last video this is from the last video situation and she has got the option uh, of selecting three types of the shirt and two types of the pants pants were gray and blue and the shirts were plain frill and uh, and lace right so there are six outcomes so we decide to go with the spinner divided into three equal parts and a coin is the simulation situation with respect to this question so hope you like the video if you like it subscribe to my channel press the bell icon button to receive another video thank you for watching